Fire crews were battling to contain a wildfire in the desert near the Gila River, roughly a quarter mile north of the Copper Creek subdivision on Monday. The fire erupted in the afternoon and was first reported to the Gila Herald at about 5.30 p.m., by which time thick black smoke could be seen rising into the air as brush and thickets of trees went up in flames. The fire was burning brush and making its way eastward, pushed by prevailing winds. A wildfire crew from the Thatcher Fire Department, including Thatcher Fire Chief Mike Payne, was on scene with a wildland firefighting vehicle, roaming through the brush and thick sand, stopping to douse trees in an attempt to guide the fire and stop its progression. The crew soon ran out of water, however, and had to temporarily leave to refill its tanks before coming back to battle the blaze some more. The fire was still burning into the night as of this report. While the fire is only roughly a quarter mile from residences, there were no structures in apparent danger from the behavior of the fire as of Monday, and it appeared to just be clearing the brush and possibly could even be beneficial. No official word was given by first responders that anyone living nearby should be worried about their property. There was also no indication on how the fire started. The fire was still seen burning as of late Monday night. Reporting from Safford for the Gila Herald, I'm John Johnson.